Travis Kessinger is a rare species. Got it. There are classes that I'm the only boy in. He's studying elementary education. The overwhelming reaction is like, oh my gosh, we need more male teachers. Like, this is great. KU's School of Education's male population isn't growing. 5% to 10% of our students are male students in our elementary program. <laughs> That's also reflected in Kansas public elementary schools. Through elementary school, I did not have a single male teacher. In the 782 Kansas public elementary schools, 93.5% of teachers are female, 6.5% are male. Wait a second! One reason... Those gender typecasts about elementary teaching and that it's a profession and a career for women. Another reason, low salaries. I would rather make a lot less money and be really happy and find something that is very rewarding. Cloud School District is the newest school district to join the list of early closings. But when headlines from the Kansas State House detail education budget cuts, the future can seem bleak. I worry that that could really dissuade some of our young people from choosing a career in education. I don't want to teach in Kansas. I also just want to move somewhere that values education more. Nationally, the numbers are similar. In the last 10 years, male elementary school teachers have decreased 6%. One consistent scale. Which is good for students like Kessinger. I may be less qualified than a female candidate, but they would take me because they want more male teachers. Perhaps being a rare species isn't so bad if it means a job after graduation. Allison Hammond, KUJH News.